Hi friends, we are learning many stories about neglected parents. Sometimes they are admitted in old age homes. Sometimes they are left to their fate. Such is the story of an old man. An old man at the age of 60s maybe. He was in 60s, he lost his wife and his problems started. There was no one to take care of him. He had only one son and daughter-in-law and they were not bothered about his uh, health conditions and about his food, everything. In, uh, actually, he was given a lot of work also by his children and he had been scolded by them for no proper reason. And he felt so depressed. He did not want to stay. One fine day, his daughter-in-law admitted the old man in old age home. And he felt more comfortable in old age home rather than in his house. Later, one fine day, his son and daughter-in-law came along with his uh, grandson. He had only one grandson and with that grandson, uh, two of them came and requested him to come and attend his birthday party. But he did not agree to come. What had happened later? Let us know everything in detail. His name was Raghav Rao. He was in his 60s. He lost his wife Janaki recently. His son was also married and the couple had one son. With the death of his wife, Raghav Rao was very much depressed and was leading his life in isolation. He was completely neglected. No one was there to take care of his health too. One day, his daughter-in-law admitted him. Raghurav felt more comfortable in the oldest home. There were many persons of his age. Each one had a pathetic story. They were talking to each other, eating together, playing some indoor games, showing concern to one another and Raghurav felt happy in their company. One day, his son and daughter-in-law came to oldest home along with their son Vinod. Seeing his grandfather, we know they embraced him. See, Dad, your grandson missed you a lot. Tomorrow is his birthday. Some of your friends are also coming. We came to take you now to our house. You can come back day after tomorrow. Raghavra understood the whole situation. If he doesn't go, his invited friends will ask about him. His son will be put in disgraceful situation for admitting him in old age home. That is why he is inviting him for one day. That's what he thought. The previous day, one more incident happened in the old age home. A lady was also admitted in the same old age home. The lady did not want to show her face. She must be feeling embarrassed for being admitted in the old age home. Raghurav felt women were more sensitive than men. One day, while he was walking in garden, saw the woman. She, he was shocked to see her. It was very familiar face. At first, Raghurav did not agree and said, I have many friends here. I don't want to come with you. His son fell on his feet and requested him to come. He agreed to go for one day. At the birthday party of Vinod, both his son and daughter-in-law pretended how much they loved him in front of their guests. Raghurav gave a sarcastic look at them for their overaction. The next day, he was ready to leave for his old age home. His daughter-in-law approached him and said, Mahaya means father-in-law, I will drop you there. Yes, my dear daughter-in-law, I have to show an important guest in the old age home. You will be very happy seeing her, he said. Raghurav's daughter-in-law was thinking, was the important guest. She was shocked to see the lady. She was her mother. My mother in this old age home? Amma, who admitted you in this old age home? Her mother replied. My daughter-in-law, she said abruptly. Amma, how could she be so unkind to you? Why didn't you come to me? Don't you know your daughter is there with for you? Come with me. Her daughter, in, her daughter said in tears. She slapped her daughter and said, Are you not ashamed of yourself? Are you talking about kindness? 
I know this is the punishment given by God for giving birth to a daughter like you. Get out of my sight, she shouted at her daughter.